So straight out of the blue. It was on a Wednesday, and this box came, and it was from Santa Monica, California. My partner Brian, he called and said, did you order something? Because I think we have a typewriter in the mail. And I slowly opened the box, and in it was a letter from Tom Hanks. He says, oh my gosh, it's from Tom Hanks. There was a beautiful typewritten letter in an emerald green envelope encouraging us to take the machine. It's yours now. Sell it, display it, restore it, repair it. In the letter, he expresses that through us, it will live on for another 100 years. And yeah, my jaw just dropped. This is a Rhine metal typewriter, East German, and they are not a common machine to see. There's a special thing about how these machines operate, how they function, how they feel to the hand. We have over 1,300 typewriters in our inventory, and we do not have one single Rhine metal. It was quite a, an honor to get a machine from Tom Hanks, but also to get a machine that's so special. This is a pretty, pretty unique machine to see. I originally started in 1975. And around 1980, I started my own shop in California called You Are My Type, and did that for a number of years. And as typewriters became less and less popular because of computers, in 1990, I closed the shop. And then one day, my wife comes to me and said, here's a typewriter of my girlfriend's. Can you take a look at it? Sure. And I did. And Here's the rest of the story. The typewriter resurgence has been steadily moving for about the past decade. People have been wanting to get back to something patient and something thoughtful, and they're experiencing digital burnout. People are getting back to something that's more patient and, and, and thoughtful. The typewriter is just you and just your words. Even though a lot of them aren't here anymore, a lot of them thrown in the trash, a lot of them are melted down, there's still so many around, lit in closets, basements, attics, and these people's children and grandchildren find them. And they bring them here and they say, this is my family's legacy. Mainly it's a typewriter repair shop, but it's become a museum and it's become a sales shop also. Tom Hanks is, has a pretty massive typewriter collection, and he's a big enthusiast, and he's very generous about sending his machines out to encourage human connection, to encourage having something in common with one another, which is something that we're excited about with this. This is going to join the ranks of our mu museum pieces because, you know, people know Tom Hanks. He sends out these typewriters from his collection across the world. It's not the first time that he sent one out, but it's the first time we've received one from him. So this is the carriage removal of the machine. It's one of very few machines that actually had the ability to remove its carriage for tuning and adjustment. It's a special typewriter to see due to its rarity and due to its prestige. It does have Tom Hanks' autograph on the hood, and you're more than welcome to use this machine in our showroom. If you want to write a letter, if you want to type your grocery list, come in and use the machine. It's not just designed to sit on a shelf. It's designed to be used. It's a, it's a brand we've never had here in the shop. There aren't that many around, but if you're a collector, or you just know about typewriters, you'll know the brand. Our emphasis is in preservation, and so what we're really trying to do is not only preserve the machines, but the history. The typewriter was king for 100 years. It was the pinnacle writing instrument, and a lot of people don't know it. People come in and they spend time in here and realize we are, we're, we're unique. We're unique in the world.